back again for another Alliance Wake 2021 gear guide review. We're in Orlando, Florida. We're about to get on the water and try out this Slingshot 150 native by Alex Graydon. Let's check it out. So tracking on this thing, uh, it's definitely on the looser side. You know, we've got nothing in the belly. But all we have are these two fins. Um, granted, the edges on this board are pretty, you know, sharp, and the tip and tail are a bit on the narrow side, so it definitely helps in the tracking. Um, but it is loose, which I did like a lot. Um, so for me, the tracking is going to come in at a six. So then that brings us into speed. Um, this board is a quick board on the water. It is continuous, and it also is a pretty big board. It's a 150, so you got a lot of surface area out there, which helps with the speed. Um, so rolling it over on edge, coming into the wake, I definitely felt like it was fast and I did like that. Um, so for me, this board is going to come in at a 9. The next thing I want to look at is pop. The pop on this board is consistent and it has to do with the continuous rock. I also think that having a bigger board kind of helps you release off that wake a little better and get a little more pop. So for me, this board is going to come in at an 8 for pop. Just like the other slingshot boards we've tested, I think are on the softer side. It has to do with a little bit of flex but the flex isn't too much to where the board's giving in to the landing. So for that, I definitely want to give it an eight and a half for landings. Um, I, I, one thing I will say is I like the tip and tails being flexy. You can kind of set the tail down and absorb that case a little easier. Um, I think it's all around pretty soft landing board. The last thing we want to check out is swing weight. And surprising enough, the board didn't feel like I was riding a 150 when I was spinning it around. So for me, the swing weight is going to come in at a six and a half. You know, I really did like this board. An overall board that has good pop, good speed. It, you can control it well, but it's loose when you want to play out there. I have no complaints on this board. Um, I think Alex Graydon and Slingshot did a really good job on this board. Um, if you guys want to know a little bit more details and more what goes into these boards, you can head over to slingshotsports.com and check them out. Did y'all see that? I know I did. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on anything else.